I've been thinking of making this video for a bit. Just haven't really had any ideas on how to do it. But what I'm going to talk about is, you know, the hurricane and stuff that's happened this week. You know, all the you know, massive hurricane on the east coast. You know, and on top of that, there was a massive amount of earthquakes near me. You know, three, <laughs> three earthquakes, six point oh and above, and eighty-three aftershocks. You know, I'll post a <laughs> video showing my area. You know, that many <laughs> earthquakes, and you know, got me thinking. Both of these things, you know, I'm not very. St didn't freak me out. I was a little concerned when it happened because I felt the initial one. You know, I'm sitting here on my computer and suddenly I'm seeing shadows across the wall where there shouldn't be. And I look back and turn off my chandeliers just swaying back and forth on my roof and make whoa. <laughs> so I check and sure enough it was a um, 7.3. No, 7.7. .7, sorry, it got changed to. But it was far enough I didn't really... F I only felt, you know, the leading edge of it. But my point here is, you know, I didn't, wasn't hugely panicked about it. You know, I've sort of, you know, let, let it happen, you know. I was, I had plans if it got worse, you know. But I wasn't going to panic and run out screaming at the top of my lungs. But, you know, what it got me thinking about is all these people that, you know, think next month, you know, the world's going to end, you know, and month and 19 days, the world's going to end on December 21st, you know, doomsday, the mind thing, we should all freak out, you know, yet, you know, that's not something we can change, you know, what, what exactly is panicking or spreading fear going to do, even if it's true, I, I, I zero belief, no, no facts show what's going to happen. But what is the panic going to do? What is it fearing this event going to do? It's just stupid. No. But on the East Coast, we have something that is at least partially, you know, caused by all these, you know, global climate change and whatnot. You know, we've had one of the worst years for just crazy weather, droughts, tornadoes, up the yin yang, floods. You know, the hurricane season is turning out to be one of the worst. And all these things, these are things we can change. These are things that we should be pushing for. But the doomsday people don't believe in them. You know, they'll believe that there's a planet going to crash with us soon. But no, no, global climate change is a complete hoax. Like, I don't get that. Why do people... F Focus on the things that, if true, we can't change, and ignore the stuff that we can change and try to fix. I don't know. And I'm not quite sure where I'm going with this. I guess it's just that, you know, what are your thoughts on this kind of stuff, you know? Do you guys fear earthquakes, tornadoes, hurricanes, these things that, like, are you in an area that could be dangerous for you to live? You know? I live in the area where we're overdue for somewhere between 8 and 9. Hopefully that 7.7 .7 was what they were predicting, you know. But every 150 years, we have a massive earthquake in our region. And we were 150 years, and the last one was about 150 years ago. So we're, overdue, we're getting into the range of being overdue for an earthquake of that size. Yet, I'm not overly concerned. If it happens, it happens. I'll be ready. But I'm not going to, you know, center my life around waiting for this horrible disaster that could destroy my region. You know. I don't know. What do you guys think on this kind of stuff? Let me know your thoughts. Comment below.